Yeah, but did you explore as, as well the, 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 the music mm. realm? No. <laughs> not, not, as, not as definitely not as much um, I mean I, I practiced I started playing drums 13 you know okay. uh, yeah about 13 maybe 12 and I mean I would come home hi mom grab some cookies go to my room and drop the needle on my record player <laughs> and and play you know and the, the goal was always to get it loud enough that I could play yeah I can hear myself as a challenge <laughs> yeah always was. you know so my poor parents but and then I would play until dinner time when they'd have to tell me three times, dinner, 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 okay, and this is the last, they're going to get really mad, i got to stop playing now. And I'd go down and I'd come back up, play, and then like 7.30 I had to stop. So I just did that for years. I was studying, I didn't know that, you know what I mean? I just was like kind of following the thread and like I said, you know, okay, the Tommy Lee thing and then, well, who's his guy, I know, and then who's that guy's guy? And just kind of getting into all that stuff. He has had this amazing career where he's been with this one band and this band is capable of doing all this different stuff. So a lot of times I would learn something but within the confines of my band there was not really a way to get it in there. Like I love Tony Thompson, you know, and uh, you know Power Station and um, Chic and all this stuff. And he's just got that, 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 you know, that urban, is that the political career? That urban groove which is there's no accents on the high it's just it's that thing. I love doing that, but that sounds so terrible in rock. It's not right. It's not, you know, it's this other thing. So if you know the band that's doing that kind of stuff, I would learn some things, but then if I don't have a situation where I can work that in, then those chops just kind of go away. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Where he has, what's that, that Latin thing you're doing? Colorado? Songo. Yeah, you know, he this Latin thing, and he worked it in the Colorado Bulldog right before the <laughs> course, which is, you know, a hot for teacher thing, but he was able to to work it in and again he had a band that was eclectic enough that okay you could put that in there we don't mm -hmm. just want you to play like you know I, I had to kind of talk him into it <laughs> really they were like what is this I don't know no, it's gonna work I swear to god it'll be fine please please <laughs> you're exactly right I, I've had a 25 years playing with these guys and they're in their own way they're really into songs and doing this but they're also into experimenting and trying new things and, and we're all about jamming especially live you know, our, our early shows, we, we used to go, you know, we used to go waff, like, you know, all kinds of stuff. And uh, I think it's, I, I really consider myself really lucky to be involved with, it's kind of a, a dream situation that I always wanted to be involved in, be in a band that's long term, and you, you get to not only play, you know, songs and sing, but you get to also kind of blow some chops and try some different things, and it's just the Best of all worlds, you know, it's really, really been great.